All of us are in the world. That's not the question. But are we of the world? Do our duties in school deprive us from reading and sharing the Word of God? Our ideas of education takes too narrow and too low a reach. There is a need for broader scope, a higher aim. True education means more than the pursuit of a certain course of study. It means more than a preparation for the life that is now. It has to do with the whole being, and with the whole period of existence possible to man. It is the harmonious development of the physical, the mental, and the spiritual powers. It prepares the students for the joy of service in this world and for the higher joy of a wider service in the world to come. What on earth are we here for? To preach and the hardest to practice, a self -denial. Because the way we think influences the way we act. It is selfishness when you are not to share the lessons you have learned from the Bible. Truth that is not lived, that is not imparted, loses its life. There is a great work to be done in our world. Men and women are to be converted, not by the gift of tongue, nor by the working of miracles, but by the preaching of Christ crucified. Why delay the effort to make the world better? Those who can enter in heaven are those who accept the principle of self-sacrificing. Let's start applying all the theories learned. Preach the word, be instant in season, out of season, reprove, rebuke, exhort with all long suffering and doctrine. Because faith without work is dead. The time is now. We are to give food to the hungry, clothing to the naked, and shelter to the homeless. And we are called to do more than this. It's time to win souls in our campuses, do Bible studies, and lift up Jesus in our boarding houses. It's laboratory time! Let's walk the talk!